Hey, how's it going everybody? I hope that you are all having an amazing day. Even more importantly, I hope that you had a great year because yes, it is now 2020, which is going to be a huge year for gaming, which means an exciting year for all of us gamers. 2019 has been a crazy year and thanks to you guys I finally hit 1k subs which is an amazing feeling so thank you all for the support. Be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel because 2020 is going to be a content packed year for this channel. In this video I'm going to go over all the leaks, all the rumors, and what my hopes and dreams are when it comes to Apex Legends Season 4. At the time I recorded this, Season 4 will only be a mere 35 days away, being released February 4th, which is exactly the one year anniversary for Apex Legends. So needless to say, Respawn are going to pull out all of the stops to make this the best season yet. There are a lot of leaks for us to dive into, but before we do, I want to start by talking about Respawn Entertainment's roadmap for Apex Legends as a whole and bring up the point that the roadmap has only been set out for four seasons in total, each of which bringing with it a new weapon, legend, and loot. Now, I'm not saying that I think Apex Legends will only have four seasons. No, I'm just trying to point out that they have had four seasons roadmapped for an entire year now and could very well have been working on certain features such as the recently data mined campaign mode this entire time. I firmly believe that season 4 is going to be a game changing season for Apex Legends and I wouldn't be surprised if Respawn releases a second roadmap at the start or near the start of season 4 that lays out plans that we couldn't even speculate at this point. So that being said, I'm extremely hyped for season 4 and would not at all be surprised if this was the season to release a more solidified storyline and perhaps even more than one legend. Being that the campaign mode is something that has been data mined, I believe that Respawn could go in a very intriguing route with Apex Legends, tying in both a campaign and a battle royale into one cohesive storyline within the Titanfall universe. Apex Legends is an amazing and polished battle royale, and I for one would love to jump into a campaign mode, whether solo or with a group, and explore the story that Respawn has to tell. I also believe that Season 4 will have more than one legend released just because of all of the information on different legends that data miners have been able to dig up over the past year. Just to name a few, Rosie or Loba, I prefer Rosie so that's what I'm going to call her, has been known about for a while now, all the way down to the abilities that she has, being Eye for Quality, which allows Rosie to see loot through walls. Supply for Demand, which reveals specific types of loot in an area, be it shields or ammo or anything I'd assume. Also, Rosie can throw a disc and teleport to that location, as well as place a device that steals nearby loot. Not only is there Rosie, but almost certainly the legend to come out at the start of Season 4 will be Revenant, whose abilities are as follows. Revenant can climb walls higher and crouch walk faster. He fires a poison dagger, which can be pressed again to reveal the target's location for up to 60 seconds. And an interesting side note about this poison dagger is that Apex Legends recently added in 32 or so charms into the game, one of which seems to be the exact poison dagger that Revenant would fire. I'll have a clip of that out on the screen or something. He also seems Oh. He also has a poison bomb that damages and slows targets hit and the craziest of all he has a totem that he can drop that will respawn you at the totem if you were to get downed or killed within a specific amount of time I'd imagine. Those are just two of the like 12 or more legends that have been data mined and are mentioned because if I were a betting man, I would put my money on both Revenant and Rosie being released in Season 4. Not only can we expect at least one new legend, but Respawn has always added in at least one new weapon as well. 
On the screen are some graphics that have been data mined, which show some possible weapons that could be added into Apex Legends come Season 4. One of which is the Charge Rifle, which as we all know was released in Season 3, but I left that graphic on here to provide a little bit more validity to the claims. Also, be aware that Respawn not only develops Apex Legends, but they are also developers of the legendary Titanfall series. So take that into consideration when looking into any leaks because some of the assets brought over into Apex Legends could merely be there for developmental slash testing purposes, but not meant to come to Apex Legends at all. Um, another weapon that might be coming in and honestly if I were to guess this would be the weapon that is going to come in is the Volt SMG uh, just because the past three seasons have all seen um, energy weapons of some way shape or form come into the game I wouldn't be surprised if Respawn not only continued that pattern but um, expanded on that pattern uh, let me know down in the comments what you are most excited for when it comes to Apex Legends season 4 is it a new legend, or perhaps the rumored return of King's Canyon? Me personally, I'm always excited to play a new legend, though normally I quickly revert back to Octane, which has become my favorite legend so far. Um, but anyways, be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel and share this video, and thank you all so much for the support. I hope you all have an amazing start to your 2020 year. I'm out.